In other news, a decade of blindness miraculously reversed in Haifa in a first-of-its-kind success story. But don't worry, there will be plenty more on the horizon. When 78-year-old Haifa resident Jamal Fouani lost his sight to edema 10 years ago, he became just one of the 30 million others worldwide who report as legally blind each year. But unlike the millions of others, Jamal is now the first patient on Earth to ever successfully regain his vision with a completely synthetic cornea, courtesy of Israeli company Corneat. Until now, corneal transplants have been rare and risky operations, with an estimated one donor cornea available for every 70 people who needed it. That makes for roughly 55% of the world's population that has no accessibility to corneal tissue, as there are too few doctors trained in corneal transplants, which take two years just to learn, and also since even if you have a cornea harvested, doctors have just one week to implant it. Corneat technology, on the other hand, has a shelf life of up to two years. And since getting approval over the summer to begin human trials, Corneat is now officially on its way towards completing a multinational trial and becoming the leading global provider for corneal tissue. As for Jamal, he's just one of 10 people approved for a trial with Corneat's implants at the Robin Medical Center, with two additional sites in Canada planned to open later this month, and six other sites at different stages of approval across the U.S., France, and the Netherlands. The trials are set to include blind patients who are not suitable candidates for or who have failed one or more corneal transplantations.